Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Michelle with Pretty's Problem, and today I have another thrift haul. I am so excited. It's been long overdue. I have had hell trying to record this video, so hopefully it comes out right. Last time I recorded it, I was supposed to actually upload it today, but when I went to go edit it, I just hated my makeup. I looked like a raccoon, so I had to try this again, and it's just been forever. So I legit have like 20 minutes to film this. I'm gonna try to rush through the pieces so that I can show you all the goodies that I got. So hopefully you enjoyed this video don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe follow me on my snapchat instagram facebook and twitter and yeah let's just get started i'm i don't have the prices anymore i'll try to write the prices in the video as i'm going along I got another one of these skirts and I don't know what kind of skirt this is called. It's like one of these flowy material skirts and it has like paisley print and it's just a long skirt that comes maybe, I don't know if you call it midi, but it comes like mid calf area. So yes, I actually bought two of these. The next skirt that I got is that same type of skirt, but this one is like houndstooth kind of print. You can't really, I don't think it's picking up really. but. It is again one of those elastic waistband skirts and then it comes, this one is a little bit shorter than the other one. Yeah, I really like these skirts on me because they come high waisted with a nice belt or whatever. So the next bottom that I have are these Charter Club slacks and if they still have the price on it, I'm just going to let you know. This was $7.99 but I got it for $4 because I got it on the half off day. So they're just plain blue slacks by Charter Club. Okay, the next thing that I have, and I didn't try this on in my try-on portion, but this is a black skirt, and this is from Styling Company. I believe this was about $3, and it's just a plain black business skirt, and it comes pretty long. It's about the same, like, mid-ankle ankle length. The next thing I got was these Ralph Lauren jeans, and these were $7.99, navy blue, and they're, they actually feel really really soft like buttery kind of feeling i paid four bucks for them and great quality um no stains they were pleated so um yes probably someone's let me not talk about these people but the next pair of jeans that i have are wide leg jeans and these are by i believe style and co so i think you can find that at like macy's and i think these were $7.99 so I may have paid four dollars for them but they're just regular denim jeans I already washed them I have worn them already and wide legs so they come wide leg all the way down to the bottom and then they have this nice little cuff on the bottom so I really like that I think that's it for my bottom so I'm gonna go ahead and move on I know you probably see my whole pile <laughs> adding up here so the next thing that I have is this sweater by Banana Republic. It's a silk cotton cashmere sweater. So it just is a plain sweater, like a kind of a grayish taupe color. And this is just good for the fall time that it, now that it's getting cooler. The next top I have is this Adrian Vit Vitadini. Vitadini. I don't know what that is, but it was a nice top just a this is like a tan color and just another long sleeve shirt I do like the little detail on the shoulder I'm not sure if you can see but it has just a little detailing on the shoulder and it's like a v-neck so yeah I like this this one is a Liz Claiborne top and it's just a lavender color just a button down these sleeves don't come full length on me so I'm probably gonna have to roll it up or get creative with the sleeves but my arms are pretty long so a lot of things don't come long on me but it's just a plain button up top that would be good it's really a spring color but it's just good for the office anyway so I grabbed it so the next thing I have is a simply Vera top and I think you can find simply Vera which is Vera wings like Vera wing which is Vera Wang's, I don't want to say bargain line, but like their more affordable line that they offer. I think you can find it in Kohl's. But this is just, it kind of looks like a bathing suit cover up. So it's like the, it's net in the front and then chiffon in the back. And this was $3.99, so I paid $2 for it. I just thought it was a cool top that I could throw over something. So maybe a tank top or something like that. The next top that I got was actually this 
interesting pattern. This kind of looked 90s to me. And this is by Mishka. I mean, it's like a three quarter sleeve. So I just really like the print of it. I thought it was unique and I would never see anybody else in it. And then it actually ties in the front. So it has two ribbons across the front and it's just like a V V neck tie type thing. But I haven't worn it yet. When I tried to wear it, I kind of was like, mm, wasn't really sure if I was feeling it. So I'm going to hold off on that one. But when I do wear it, I will post the picture. The next thing I have is this New York & Company sweater. And this is just a sweater to go over my clothes. I, last time I, I struggled, I literally struggled to get this video out. It was, it was just a nightmare. So I don't know if I actually made it to this sweater, but it's just one of those preppy sweaters that you can wear in the office long sleeve if it's cold i actually might bring this with me today since i'm seeing it here so the next top that i got is this sweater and it's another liz claiborne i told you liz claiborne is really popular at the thrift shop but it's this nice designed sweater not designed but it has some kind of i don't know it's a knit sweater and it has that pattern on it and i thought it just was a really nice sweater it looked really comfy and cozy for the upcoming winter months and I loved the neck, the collar of it. So yeah, this was just a nice sweater and I just thought it just looked cozy. That's really more so why I went for this one. Now on to jackets. I found this baby at the Salvation Army on in my infamous trip to Key West. And this is by Requirements Petite and it's a size 14. It's kind of tight on my arms, but I just like the blazer um it's i believe it's a three-fourth sleeve because it doesn't quite come all the way down on my arms but that is normal with me so i just went for it anyway and yeah it's just a plain basic staple blazer that i can kind of throw on with anything jeans and a top and then i got this a few weeks ago this is by ralph lauren it's a herringbone pattern jacket and this one also comes weird on my arms so I told you I have like chimpanzee arms <laughs> I probably need to walk with my arms so this comes kind of short but it was just such a nice jacket that I couldn't pass it up and this is not this was $9.99 so I paid five dollars for it and it's a size 14 but it's just a really nice jacket I love this little detail around the collar it's like a little buckle and then I love the herringbone print and this is what the sleeves look like so i mean i don't know if i can roll it up or just keep my hands in the pocket it has pockets and it has little buttons around the back the next jacket i got is a plain i got this from the goodwill and it's i think it was about five dollars but um it's by kim rogers and it's a plain red jacket and i just thought this was a nice jacket for fall it's a lightweight jacket and I actually was walking through um, Walmart and I saw some scarves hanging up and they were on sale. So I grabbed one and they were on sale for $5, which was okay, whatever. So I just thought it would go good with that jacket. So this is what it looks like. And it's a round scarf, so it doesn't have any beginning or end. And it has these little tassels. I just thought it was cute to like wrap, double wrap around in the, in the fall time to go around with this jacket so it just stood out to me and so that's my little that's gonna be my one of my jacket picks i've never had a red jacket so i said to hell with it let me just try and see how that goes so this is i believe the last jacket that i bought and this is a size large and it's by rqt which again i don't know who that is but it's a similar kind of style it's like one of those lightweight jackets this one also is kind of short on my arms but because it's this color i can wear gold accessories on my wrist and kind of mask the fact that it's too short but i just like the jacket and it was, again it was like five bucks so um it fit besides the arm the sleeves so yeah just another plain jacket and it has like this detailing and embroidered on it so i like that i actually have two extra things that i picked up this past weekend that i didn't try on so i'm gonna just kind of show you those but the last thing for my try on part of the video is definitely my oh you know what i have two more things i gotta go get out of my closet i don't even know how to 
this skirt I actually just walked in and kind of like passed it and was like ah, ah, ah. and I checked it. it still has the tags so no one's ever worn it it is my perfect size especially after I lose a little bit of this midsection because <laughs> I got a little bloated over these past few weeks and it was $20.99 100 and wait till you guys see this when I say total fall skirt and it's like a long skirt and it's like that um, army green color it looks like it's a not alligator but some kind of skin print on it and I got it on Wednesday for $10 can you beat that? A brand new 100% leather skirt. This has been definitely been one of my favorite purchases so far. I'm definitely going to wear this with some black, thick black tights with some kind of, I'm not sure what top yet. And then those boots, oh, I cannot wait to wear it. It feels so soft. Um, so this is what I'm talking about. When you go thrifting, you find gems like this. And I have another two. I have to go in my closet and get because I don't know how they made it over there. But before I do that, I'm going to show you these two other pieces that I picked up this past week. And that is these jeans, which I always have a hard time finding pants because baby got back. Okay. But these are a pair of Lucky Brand jeans. And I didn't even realize that the tag was kind of hanging off, but you know, it's whatever. They're just plain jeans, blue jeans. I didn't try them on, but you know jeans are jeans you get the point and they're great condition they button up the front rather than the zip and then I have this J. Crew sweater that I picked up and it's my size it was half I think it was half off it may not have been half off but it was at the Goodwill so it was probably like five dollars but I figured for J. Crew sweater it was worth it but this is more like of a springtime color <clears throat> but I did wear this in my video that I'm posting today which is a um, get ready with me and thrifted outfit of the day so yeah three quarter sleeves it's picking up kind of blue on camera but it's more it's more greenish color so that's that let me go and pick up the last two items that I remember actually trying on I don't know how they made it out of this pile but I will be right back first thing is a Lord and Taylor blazer when I seen this I was like girl I gotta get this so this is just a houndstooth a large houndstooth blazer exclusively for you Lord and Taylor and it does have shoulder pads so it's giving me real 1990s tees or 80s and they don't come out so I don't know if there's a way that I can get them out without taking them to the cleaners but either way this this was just the bomb and it has these gold buttons on them I just love this blazer so yeah i'm going to definitely be rocking that soon and then the last thing is another brand new item i got it was by cold water creek tag still on it even the price tag and the price tag the original msrp was 99.99 i got it for 12.99 tag 6.99 price or six dollars whatever some 650 and it is this 100% leather suede vest. How freaking cute is this? So somebody bought this and just did not ever wear it. Or maybe it came straight from the store, I'm not sure. But it has these laser cutout detail in it, if you can see that. I just thought this was really cool. So $6, brand new. I figured it wouldn't hurt to have it in my wardrobe. So guys, that concludes the video for today. I hope you enjoyed this. I really love doing these, even though they take a little while and it can get a little hectic filming them. But I really hope you enjoy these videos. So don't forget to give a thumbs up so that I know you like these videos and I will continue to make these for you. So I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Real nice and sink up, pay my skin to your heart beating.